guys, today we're going to be doing my makeup collection. And yes, I'm wearing the same shirt that you saw in the last two videos because when I film, I film, okay? And I don't know how to film, so yeah. Um, first things first, I have this poof that came out of my Airspun powder. I have Airspun and the translucent. So I'm not going to show you that because it's translucent. Um, I have this Merle Norman sheer face powder in translucent. I have this Rimmel Stay Matte powder. I love this stuff in transparent. And then I have these Wet n Wild lashes. I actually really, really like these. These are, I think it's called Shredding the Fringe. This is what the back looks like. I actually got these at Dollar Tree, but I love those so much. Those are my second pair of them. Um, you, I do not have a lot of makeup, but I hope that I get more makeup by doing makeup videos. Okay. This is a Wet n Wild Color Con bronzer. It looks pink on camera, but it is not. It is just a very pale there kind of it's just a very pale um bronzer because i am very pale this is in the shade take it to brazil yeah i thought it said take it and i was like what and then i got the same thing but halo hello halo so that's a afterglow sex wow and it just looks like that. It looks like that. I am so weird, guys. I have this Merle Norman. And it's just, it literally just says bronzing powder duo. So this is what the inside looks like. I don't even... I just glared you guys with your reflection. Sorry. This, my mother gave to me because she bought it, and boy, um, it's just Merle Norman again. Merle Norman is a very hypoallergenic brand, and so it's one of the only ones I can use, but I've been testing out other brands, um, because they haven't been hurting my skin as much, but it's pink. It's like neon. Oop, the brush came out. It's like neon pink. All right, what do we have next? I actually am going to show you this thing I've never tried before. Um, I got them actually at Dollar General. It was in my haul. No, it wasn't. This was a different time. Um, they're the magnetic lashes. Do you see that? Do you see the magnetic lashes? I'm crazy. I am so excited for this. I'm just going to show you right now. So, this is Hard Candy Glamo Flop. No, I haven't tried this one yet. This are the basically the same color, so I'm hoping this Hard Candy Glamouflage 16 hour wear in 1501 Ultra Light. That's the color of it. It's very white. This is the one that worked so well that matched my skin. I was so happy. It's Revlon Photo Ready Candid in 130. Do you see the color? Do you see the color? I love that. The one I was always maybe was staring at me. Do you guys see this? Um, the one I always used before that was this Merle Norman CC Broad Spectrum, Broad spe Spectrum, whatever, in light ivory. But this one got too dark for me. It got too dark. I'm going to show you my, this, I was so excited, I got this the other day because I was practicing my wedding makeup, and boy, boy oh boy am I excited, it's actually light enough. Um, it's called the e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer, and it is pale, it is like white, I got fair rose, there you go, fair rose, I also got this. It doesn't have a name. Oh yeah, it does. It's clear. It's just this e.l.f. Um, that's not good. 
That was the wrong side. It's just, um, you see it? It's just like a little wax pen. I use it for my eyebrows. Um, let me get both of these. Um, this is just a Merle Norman black eyeliner. It's just a regular black eye that is beat to hell. Um, this, I really like this because it's, sh Mavis, what are you doing? Mavis, what are you doing? <laughs> Bless you. Look, I'm filming a video. Look, I'm filming a video. You gotta leave me alone. Um, this is a Merle Norman Twist and Point Eyeliner. Because it, like, you twist it the opposite way and it sharpens it. Um, I got a Real Techniques Tech, I can't speak today. Real Technique Beauty Sponge. Um, Mavis, what are you doing? Okay, I'm going to show you my eyeshadows now. I got this Merle Norman Eye. Does this have a mirror in it? Yes. Uh, uh, looks like that. It is Eye Color Quad Shine. Can you see that? I got this at TJ Maxx and I was super excited about it. It's called the Rose Gold Eyeshadow Palette. It's by e.l.f. Look at it. Look at this baby. Ah! Look at it. It doesn't shine as much as it does in person, but yeah, no. Um, this is also Merle Norman. This is called the Pro Eye Color Palette. This is crazy, too. My mom got this and can't use it. So... This is called the Merle Norman Miami Spice. I really like this one. It's just a simple. This I love. It's Bite Size Eyeshadow in Rose Water by e.l.f. Let me see if I can actually pick this one. Yeah, I can. Okay. These have these weird little tags on them, so they freak me out. Not freak me out, but it like. Um, this is brand new. It still has the tape on it. Um, but it's Color Spell Atlantis, and I got it because my fiance loves blue eyeshadow on me, and this has like six blue eyeshadows in it. That is why I got that. And then my favorite palettes of all time. Can you guess what brand? Morphe. I got rid of four or five Morphe palettes, and I was so bummed out. Like, I was so sad. I don't know why I did that. This is in 25A. I still have all the plastic things. I don't like to get rid of them. It's probably a quarter-ish. This one is 25D. And then the rest. Oh, I have an anti-redness foundation primer from Merle Norman. It's just the green one. Um, the rest is like lipsticks and stuff. I'll show you the mascara that I really like. So I really like this Lash Lift Waterproof Mascara because I don't know if y'all have a problem, but I have a problem with it transferring to down here and then just destroying. Uh, and then I really like this one. It's an e.l.f. one. It's a new one for me at least. And it's Waterproof Length and Volume Mascara. So it's like, it does everything. So I really like that. Um, oh, I forgot an eyeshadow. Coco, Coco Cashmere. I can't even see it because the uh, it's just a shimmery brown color. Um, there's another one of those pencils. It's brown though. Okay, here's more eyeshadow. This is an Oyster and Sky. It's a blue and a white. Is that blue? I hope it's blue. Red, unless I'm colorblind. I have two blushes. One in Sugar Melon. Oh, the eyeshadow, both the last eyeshadows, the blue and the brown, were both from Merle Norman, and so are these. This is Mauve Magic. Um, the rest is like lip, nope, nope it's not. The rest, after these four items, is just lip gloss. And so, this is an eyeshadow primer from Merle Norman. 
Uh, it, uh, it's just an eyeshadow primer. It doesn't have a color or anything. This is black. It is a felt tip eyeliner from e.l.f. This is a Merle Norman Pearl Glow. It's just like a loose eyeshadow pigment thing. Like that. Um, and then this is a Merle Norman... It's called a Shadow Liner Liquid Eyeliner. And I have it in C. And it's like this blue, like this teal color. I was going to open it, but then it started leaking everywhere. Um, so my lipstick's really fast because this is already a 10 minute video. Um, I have... <gasps> that did not just happen to me! It fell out. Okay, well I had... I'll try to use it. City Girl. My favorite of all time from this brand, Merle Norman, is Guava. Can you see that? Whatever. It's just like a pretty nude color. And I have two. I have a bunch of chapsticks that I'm not going to show you. Because I literally have a handful of them. I love these lip polishes from... Excuse me. Excuse me. Um, from Merle Norman. This one is in Life's a Peach. And then this one is in Brown Sugar. I have this Wet n Wild one that I've never worn again. Sunset Peach. It's just like a pink color. I have this Elf one. That is in Classy. I really like this pink color too. Um... This, okay, I'm going to show you this one. This one is my red liquid lipstick. It doesn't have a color, but it's from Merle Norman. And then this is my wildest, this is my last, but my wildest is gold. Just straight up, just straight up gold. Say bye, Mavis. Say thank you for watching. Say thank you for watching. Thank you guys. Have a great day.